the day <laughs> yeah and we believe that we fixed our issues yeah and I, mean, I know we say that every week but, but we like really real yeah, this I mean, time like, we really are pretty confident i mean you can you can probably, tell the yeah, picture looks way better than normal you can hear it in our voice like this the yeah. stars have aligned yeah it's not 10 o'clock so we're not drunk yet right <laughs> you guys are good to go so we're excited to bring you the best coverage that we possibly can while we're not drunk and things are going so well. So here we go. Um, you've seen both of these guys plenty. Mr. Carmel Salinas and Isaiah Mosier. Yeah, you've never heard these names before. Ever. But here we are. All right, so Carmel's on the classic Carmel. Yeah, um, this is... So four-color four color control is the most dominant archetype in modern. And I keep hearing that Burn just preys on it. And so I guess I want to see... Yeah, I, I mean, I don't quite buy that just from it being I mean, said. Like, if Omnath gets, if he gets on tap with Omnath, he just wins, right? I have, I, yeah. So he has to, but murder him before the Omnath comes. Uh, apparently, down. they're pretty good at doing that. I mean, it will be pretty nice actually to see Carmel on. It's been a minute since we've seen him play just straight up burn. So yeah, I mean, this is his, uh, this is his natural habitat here for sure. <laughs> see, yeah, Carmel in the wild is his natural yeah. habitat, setting things on fire. <laughs> yeah, the names of the mics are all mixed around. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, and the names don't matter. Nothing matters. All right, some resolving mulligans here. Yeah, no, it's, a, it's fucking exciting to be back and do a good fucking stream finally. Again. Oh, Irene, Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. It's been too long. So I got a chance to... Jam against Isaiah earlier with the uh, my mono white deck. Some pretty good games. Even though I'm, I always like go into an Omnath match with like so much less enthusiasm than I do any other match. There's just something about the card that just makes me like fucking just droop my shoulders. <laughs> Which card? Omnath. It, it's, just, like, it's really all it's the draining. cards, man. It's like turn two, Renin six, and yeah, two, no, it's just, turn three. Fucking Teferi and yeah. then ten, turn four Omnath. It's, it's too, and it's, it's just too like, much. Too those much. are just like the worst cards. It just plays all the worst cards. So Isaiah, and that's his, assuming that it would turn one monkey, depending on the build. Isaiah, I don't think he's playing monkeys. Um, here's a good turn one from Carmel, the turn one. Oh, yeah, it's just um, over. That's like the best turn Isaiah one. Isaiah is playing Ewit Ephemerae stuff, so that could get kind of gross. There's a prismatic. That's the perfect answer. I think he this hand might be pretty good. You wanna check yeah, out he his says hand. that he never wins. Never, I never win. He says. Well, Carmel's got some burn cards. <laughs> um, Man, these hand cameras are fucking in perfect spots. Yeah, moving them over so that they are like they're now hand cameras instead of head cameras. Yeah. Uh, it was a good call. I mean, I forgot how just, clever just I had am. To, just had to work out the kinks, man. Yeah. Let's try to work out the kinks. All right, so still, still trying to get a look at Isaiah's hand here. I saw an ephemerate. I know he's got an ephemerate in there, so he could do this, the solitude ephemerate. We thing. gotta flip these around, John. Are they? No, yeah. that's left. I know, but I just changed it because right was a top, oh. and and like I kept clicking on it, thinking it was going to show this oh. one. Okay, well. I don't know. Yeah, we got the we got the, the English translation. Yes, has been fucky. Okay, here's a run in six, getting the land back. Uh, All right, so this is gonna blow out. I see a solitude. He's got a counter spell. I guess what he doesn't have is the Omnath. I don't think he's gonna have a hard time here. He doesn't have the Omnath, but he has solitude ephemerate. So as soon as Carmel gives him targets, then he's just fucking amazing. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, you know, I watched, uh, um, I watched somebody playing the other day and I won't mention the name. I'll mention the name. Uh, yeah. Uh, I saw somebody playing the other day and they, they did the ephemerate solitude thing. And, um, there was only one creature on the battlefield, and I thought it was just kind of like a waste of an ephemerate. Like, it, you it spend is. an ephemerate just to get a 3-2 on board right? and make sure your opponent doesn't play a creature for a turn. I don't know. I just thought it was kind of a waste. And he also did it on his turn. Right. 
Well, that's especially a waste. Yeah, and that's, it, that's it, unforgivable. Uh, what the fuck? I don't want to name the name, but if you, if you think you might have done it, um, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> and and I mean, by you're right, I mean you were wrong. You I should not have done that. So this is, oh, goddamn. Has Carmel really been stuck on one this entire time? That is fucking terrible. God, that sucks. Okay, so he maybe could have murdered Isaiah, but he's been stuck on one, so... I think I think it actually was the computer, Randy. I think he had to change out a video card or something. I don't know. But things are are good now, so it's all good. Things have been resolved. Yeah, all right. And here we are watching so, Carmel is this the die to a one land what, what, What's he got? I don't know. I'm mean, would be great. I think I think Carmel's dying to a one land hand. Oh that's yeah, what's he really, is. What's really happening? Yeah, here. Isaiah says he never wins, and then as it turns out. Um, you do win. There's no never. There's no never in magic. No oh, endurance. That's also hard okay. for him to get through. Yeah, want to want to get those fetch lands back. Sure. Just made your Renin sick trash. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what probably, are you doing, Isaac? <laughs> I probably would have just cast as a three four because it is a may, right? You don't have to. Yeah, you don't have to. Yeah, three four body is like fine here, but yeah, really, Carmel is just fucked because he has one land in play. That's that's really just terrible and just awful. Well, thank I you, mean, Andy. We we will do our best. So yeah, um, Carmel is still fucked. That's always sad. You never want to see somebody lose to lands. It's like the worst thing. Caden Wee, I think is Caden Weaver, says, yo, yo, What's Caden up? Weaver. How's it going? You been playing some magic? I hope so. Yeah, yeah we're uh, learning a... He just plus, a no plus? He didn't do anything. Yeah. Um, Interesting. Yeah, it's a strategy. Bolt. Yeah, once Omnath comes down. Yeah, is... but if it doesn't, he's still just kind of dead here. Yeah. So, and that's a, that would actually be hilarious in all of Isaiah's. I guess what Isaiah <laughs> needs to do is um, this actually would be a good time if uh, if Carmel taps out for something here. Like oh, sick. Solitude's an ephemerate. Yeah, just, just to be able to attack with endurance. a lifelinker. Yeah. Or, or yeah, he has that option. Yeah, he totally has that option. But uh, right now it wouldn't be good because he would be playing into a skull crack, which I yeah. did see in Carmel's hand. No, yeah, that's something you hold up. I, I do that a lot with my mono white. Is if I'm playing against Burn, like I'm prepared to solitude my own shit if need be. Oh, your mom's getting the Freddy Krueger. Yeah. Oh, yeah. nice. Very yeah, nice. I figured that was. I figured that was you. Yeah, man. Keep playing Magic. If you got any questions, feel free to, to hit us up and definitely watch. If you got questions. Uh, you can ask this question too about what the fuck's going on because we do go kind of fast. Yeah. <laughs> so we can explain things and we're happy to. It makes for better coverage. Yeah, what we're seeing now is uh, that one land hands that turn into a uh, turn six, two land hand is not really the way to go. No, but I mean, it's not that he's completely boned. I mean, we know he's completely boned probably, but I mean. Yeah, this is going to be rough because Isaiah, seems like Isaiah, he Isaiah is going to get to do his trick here, I think. I think he's going to get a lifelink hit in. Caden says he's very confused. So basically, Carmel is playing Burn, which is just a uh, red deck that just does damage directly to your opponent's face. And Isaiah is playing a very grindy four-color control deck that gets to have just really all the value in the world. And in this case, uh, Carmel plays uh, Boros Charm, which does four directly to Isaiah's face. So he's... If it weren't for that ephemerate yeah, in Isaiah's is, hand... This is the thing, here. man. This is the thing, is... Uh, Burn can just kind of get there. I mean, if he plays land here, Isaiah is just kind of dead. Yeah. Yeah, if he uh, dies to a one land hand <laughs> from Carmel, then yeah. Yeah, then I it agree is confirmed with you. You that just, Isaiah you will just always lose. never win. Okay, so he's pulling the trigger. Wait, wait, wait. Is this is this yeah. a searing blaze? It is. He didn't play a land this turn. It was just a one damage. Interesting. 
<laughs> what are you doing, Isaiah? <laughs> He's just like, oh, ephemerate my thing for no reason. Man, imagine if Isaiah had Lightning Bolt. All right, you can take his opponent down to one here. Make it to where he can't tap that other land. So, Carmel's down to one land again. <laughs> Who's who? Um, guy on the left is Carmel. It's player one. And then Isaiah is on the right. It's player two. All right. Little Teferi, I think, is going to seal yeah, this one. Yeah, I mean... Yep. All really, right, that, so we are... Putting them down to an unusable <laughs> land is pretty... That was pretty much it. All right, so we didn't really see... A real match there, not really. Yeah. Um, um, yeah, it's just the, the one lander sometimes can get away from you. But yeah. you can see Isaiah said this is an unwinnable match and he wins game one. But, like, it took Carmel literally doing nothing for six yeah. turns. And he still got fairly close to killing Isaiah with one land. So that speaks to what burn is and what burn does. All right, I missed the first three cards that Isaiah put first down, but the, the second two were Dovin's Vetoes, which uh, just counter a non-creature spell. Yeah, it seems fine. Counter spell seems fine. So a Firecraft. I like that from Carmel. But you can also look at it as if, uh, if Isaiah would have... He also won that uh, without ever getting the Omnath in play. Uh, any fun decks being played in the shop tonight? Um, um, we got, we got. It's a lot of usual suspects. There's nothing super creative. Um, we do, we do have some guys that are newer to playing modern, so you're gonna see some weirder stuff there. Yeah. So um, if, the, if any of the newer guys end up on camera, you might be seeing some maybe like budget builds. Right. Of, like I think we have a couple budget blue white control decks. Yeah. We've got a zombies deck that is just somebody really that's really new to the game learning how this works. So yeah, which I'm just happy to see people coming out and actually playing in the tournament, even if they are new. There's a mill deck that is literally just mono blue mill instead of blue black mill. Which honestly, dude, like the list blue black mill, all the mill cards are just blue <laughs> anymore. Yeah, yeah. The, the problem is you removal. don't get the the thing you really lose are just the fatal pushes and the uh, Isaiah's cutting the, the drown in the lock, which not being able oh, to remove anything. Yeah, those, is, are, those are really good sideboards from Isaiah there. Two Chalice, two Vetoes, and the Knight thing. That's good. Yeah, uh, Chalice isn't, like, the best against Burn. It's helpful. I mean, it's I not... mean, like, Chalice on two is pretty good, but that's... Eh, Chalice on yeah. one doesn't hold, do a whole lot. It does. Uh, they have a lot of one drops that are actually three drops yeah, these days, yeah. and that's, no, that's a, it used to be really good against. But burn. I mean, it does it does force them to cast those things for maybe forces them to cast some of those things for three. So, but uh, well, I mean, they still they can still cast it for one mana. Oh, in this, yeah, there's yeah, a change. It's, it's CMC. a CMC true, thing, so true, yeah. yeah true. So really, it shuts down the it shuts down the things that they're playing generally on turn one. Yeah. Well, it, you, you can get a you can get a lightning bolt. You can get yeah. a, a, a lava does. spike, but like, it's it's not as good as you like. I'm not saying that you don't bring it in, but yeah. it's not as good as no, you would no. think the, it the would premium, be. The premium the premium has changed. Um, but yeah, otherwise everything is pretty much the same. Patrick's playing my goofy mono white thing, so I don't know if anybody calls that fun. I think it's fun, but people that play uh, against I'll tell you, it don't. I'll tell you something <laughs> fun that we might see. Uh, Michael Dashner, uh, the uh, reigning, uh, he's one of the last two invitationals. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's playing Elves tonight, which so, is uh, kind of not really a meta call, but it's just one of those decks that's always good. So well, that, that's something we could see. It's something that, that would be fun because... Uh, um, buying you five to six turns, that's... Eh, I don't know about that. That's that's situationally dependent. I like mean, it, if, it's gonna if buy they just you, turn one, like, one mana thing and then have a bunch of two mana burn spells, like, Chalice is just going to get you dead. Yeah. But really, if it buys them enough time to get to Omnath, that's all he really needs. Exactly. Yeah. Omnath will buy you a million turns. I mean, Omnath just turns the fucking corner, so... <laughs> now, the fun thing about... Like, Elves aren't a fun deck, but... Elves are so far out of what we've seen Mike play that that's going to be fun. Oh, wow. So, um, interesting here. Uh, Carmel had to mulligan this because it was a, uh, a five lander, but 
the contents of that hand, the two spells, were a Lava Spike, which he would have played on turn one. Isaiah's uh, turn two play would have been Chalice of the Void, and Carmel, uh, his other spell was Prismatic Ending. Oh. So that would have just been the hand. Was he, was he low on lands? It, he had five lands. It was, it was a two-spell hand. Just saying that uh, he even has answers to the Chalice in this version of, of well, burn what we're what we're saying for the chalice thing is that it can buy you a lot of turns but it's just it's situational it depends on everybody's hand yeah it's just not my, my point with the chalice against burn is just not as good against burn like it used to be you play against burn they just can't win and it's not as much the case now is he gonna keep another shitty oh no oh no is he going down to burn on the mold of five? You, you know what? Oof. You know what, Isaiah? You know how you know how this is a, a winnable matchup because it's Magic the Gathering, and sometimes shit happens. Sometimes <laughs> your uh, your ninety percent opponent just doesn't have the nuts. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, I think it's a sideboard card only. Yeah, which makes sense. I mean, it yeah, has yeah, three a, colors technically, or can at least it has two for sure. You can sneak in the third if it wants to. I think if any deck has access to white and you're not playing Prismatic Ending and you're 75, you're just kind of like... Yeah, it's pretty silly. You're just doing it wrong. And I, I and that's coming from me. Yeah. That's coming from the guy that plays fucking stupid shit. So if I'm saying that, then... Yeah, and also, <laughs> also you're also the guy that hates it when it's like, well, if you're playing this, then you should just be... Play- you hate that. Yeah, but... You, you, you hate know, that. You, you, I hate it, but there is a line... That, oh, my God. ...that, ha- that cannot oh be crossed. Is he going to He's going back to the well, John. Oh, shit. Have you ever seen Burn win a win a game on a mulligan to four? <laughs> I haven't. We'll see, man. Well, Isaiah's probably feeling a lot better about this matchup so, right now. Did he bring in the Roiling Vortex? He did. He did. Yeah. I mean, if he has, if he gets to start with that, that uh, is that even that good though? No, it's not. But I'm just saying. It's in like, his hand. I mean, I don't even. I mean, this is he's gonna keep this hand, but okay, keep two lands. There you go. And I think I think he's keeping one land, and I think that that's right. No, he's Wait. keeping two. That's his keep right there. There's two lands in there. Okay. I think two lands is right. I don't see how he's ever gonna win this. This looks like a. I think he already lost. We'll see. I mean, oof. what would be the right. best? How to learn to play? Um... Really, man, you just kind of got to... Observing people play is great. Um, and just really putting your feet in the water is how is the best way to learn. Um, um, just for the basics, uh, Magic the Gathering Arena is a free thing that you can download at yeah. home. We don't. You'll hear us talk shit about it a lot online because it's it really is for beginners, but that's fine. Right? Yeah, you're like, a that's beginner, fine. so that's exactly yeah, it, uh, it's for you. And then once you get kind of comfortable playing that, then you can come in and take some lumps playing against actual people, and and you'll just get better. Like yeah. You, you, once you once you go to a store and start playing against ag- actual people, it's 100. percent You're gonna lose at first, yeah. but that that's cool because. They all go through it, you know. What the all, fuck is that? All the thing? players go through it. Um, some card that I'm sure we know what it is and <laughs> just can't don't know what this art is. What's that card, Carmel? Eidolon is a great robot. Eidolon. It's not Eidolon. Nah. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Some funky art of Eidolon of the Great yeah. Rebel that I've never seen before. All right. There's the uh, Solitude. Uh, I don't get any it. punishment from there. And there is a chalice. Now this chalice is definitely in top deck mode with such a shitty hand. That chalice is gonna buy him plenty of time. Get that vortex down. No, he's still not. What what did he play? It was vortex. Oh, was it? Okay. But yeah, uh Caden, definitely um Arena is a good starting point. It's gonna help you learn most of the basics. The thing that I don't the, like the, about the, Arena is it's gonna help you skip over some stuff. But that's fine. Gonna, when you're learning, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. You'll unlearn a little bit when you start playing real magic. The, 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 the best thing about Arena, that it, like, because we say a lot of bad things about the, the best thing about it, though, it is a way for you to learn the game for free. Yeah, exactly. Without putting exactly. any money into it whatsoever. Getting the app is it's only on Apple. Oh, well, you can play it on a P. Do you have a desktop? You can play it on desktop, right? Yeah, just play it on your computer. Yeah. If you have a, a laptop or a desktop, you can play it there. And if you just want to come in and play, man, come in on Tuesdays. 
coming on Wednesdays. We can sit down, show you the ropes. Don't start playing with Commander, please. Just don't do that. That's no education in magic. That is the wrong way to start. <laughs> I don't know exactly what's going on with this uh, with this mountain that Carmel has in play. It looks like a mountain with just a oh, bunch of yeah. text. Oh, yeah, it's the, it's the old text mountain. It's just, the, it's just, text a, basics. just a bunch of text on it. I think it looks pretty cool, though. So it says it, it lays out all the like state-based actual mechanics of lands. Oh, okay. I think they're really neat. I think it looks. I think they're neat. neat. It looks yeah. like I normally hate the big dorky mana symbol, but I like that it's just the big dorky yeah. mana symbol and then text. Ocean of text. Yeah. yeah. No, no, I like those things. I, a lot I think it's kind of neat. All right, here's an endurance. Okay. All right. So activate Carmel. All right. So this is on math when it second. comes in. Okay. Uh, he no gets to draw drop. a card. Uh, that was, I. Uh, I think he had to play the land drop to play it, didn't he? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So the good thing for that Vortex is he's going to stop him from gaining any life here. Oh, yeah. He has to hold it up, but that is a thing. Yeah, we, we appreciate the positive plug there. Cool. Yeah, man. Stop on in. We can, we can show you. If I'm busy, Tommy can show you the ropes. Isaiah can sit in. Well, Tuesdays, Isaiah is out, but Tommy can. So, yeah, Commander is how a lot of people start playing nowadays, but... It's it doesn't really teach you the game, really. It does in a way, but not you you miss a lot of the game. And you get lazy and sloppy with the game when you learn to play through Commander. Alright, Carmel is definitely not out of this, but he's not this in great is, shape. This has become a real interesting thing here with this uh just kind of the, the little in game game with yeah. the uh, the vortex because Isaiah's I got mean, <laughs> Isaiah's got some uh, life gain on tap. Oh, and, nothing. Oh, okay, yeah, that's that just was it. it. He just had nothing to say. And, and, and so yeah, uh, uh, burn on a mulligan to four just doesn't win. Yeah, commander does teach you how to be a bad player. That's exactly what it does. And then when you learn, and, and, and more than that, a yeah. bad person. <laughs> <laughs> so I think that there's a good amount of variance. In Carmel's loss here, one land hand, or you know, being stuck on one land, game one, game two, having to pull down to four, that shit is just, that's yeah, rough. That's so rough. So we didn't really see a good match here, and it could have no, been a much better it, match. It wasn't. It could have been it, a better. It, it match. was supposed to be. It was supposed to be a runaway too, and that's the sad thing. Um, you know what? We have a full house tonight, so I have to believe that there's somebody out there that's yeah. still on game one, and we still got uh, 28 minutes left in this round. So we're gonna go try to find yeah. somebody. Right. We're, we're gonna go scour the room. So stay tuned. Stay tuned. Hopefully, we'll be right back. 